Welcome to another one guys, we're back at St. Key. Uh, a lot of people today on the jetty. We're kind of slow right now, finally we're getting some break from this rain. It's been raining for a few days. I think today said no chances of rain, but look like we might have some for the morning. Hope not, because I just got here, meeting here with Carlos from Fishing with Lowe's. There'll be two of us. Uh, Shipset fishing, Pompano, uh, some plastic. So right now, I have one on um, a free lining, or actually I have a small split shot, 15 pound main line, number one or number two J hook, I don't remember. And my second setup is not on the Pompano, it's on a DOA. Since I have everybody here uh, Pompano jigging for me, I don't want to waste my time with that. If they catch, then they switch. But yeah, the idea is trying first to see if we can locate some sheep's head. Lost leg tide right now. I'm hoping that the incoming tide gonna bring us some sheep's head and some Pompano. So yeah. That's the idea, guys. We're ready. We collected plenty of these beauties. Look at that. Look at these guys, all active. All active, that's what we want. Hoping to see some fish right now. I haven't seen anybody catching anything, so I don't know if they're here or not, but. We're gonna leave that split shot for now, even though it's slack tight, we don't really need it. Mangrove tree crabs, it's easier to have a tiny split shot because they kind of swim, they kind of stay on top of the water. Not like uh, uh, fiddlers or mud crabs, mud crabs go straight, they fall like a rock. Let's hope for our targeted species. Today we're keeping some. Fish on, like I said, there are some. Oh, big snow came to eat him. Oh man, I don't know if I got that on the camera. That was a nice snow, guys, over 30 for sure. He chased the sheepy. What he was planning to do with this sheepy? I don't think he can eat him. Let me try the DOA a few minutes. That was a good size snow All right, back on the crabby. If we see the snooky again, we're gonna go back on the DOA. So I don't know which way you went. Let's not waste our time. If it's skippy first. Get the big sheep in now. Good job. You are eating my crabby. Is that you? We got the thief. All right, let's throw a couple times on the beach side. See if any anything good here. Low tide though. Pigeon. Targeted species. He might be on the edge. I'm not here for. For the one on the edge, Lucy. Look at these teeth. Jesus, let go already. Nice. Ship set number two. We're looking for a fat one though. We're looking for a fat one. pretty good there you go let's not lose this oh fish on guys oh that's a drum I think that's a nice drum 
Oh no, that's a nice seepage. Look at him. That's a giant. That's a, uh. There you go. Thought that was a drum. Drum my crabbies. All right, chippy number one. Thirteen or maybe thirteen and a half. I don't know. He might make fourteen. We'll see. Let's go, Carlos. Let's catch those big ones now. Carlos is here next to me now. We're gonna aim for some big sheepies today. If Pampanos bite, that's a that's a plus. There he goes. Fichon. Oh, that's a good one. Lost him? Man, they're fighting good. Oh, actually, I got him on the eye. Felt like he was a giant. I got him through the eye. I mean, not on the eye. Actually, kind of on the eye. Tiny. Well, it's part of fishing, so. We don't know small ones or big ones the idea is to catch man mullet so thick that's why this shark is lurking around here fish oh oh that's a good one that's a nice one. oh that's a that's is that a drum or redfish that's a nice one though Let's not lose him. Oh, that's a nice red, bro. That's a nice red. Nice. Look at that. Don't go by the rock. I wish I had my uh, my net with me. Man, he's fighting. That's a nice one. I hope he doesn't cut me by the rocks. I'm only using 15 pound uh, leader line. Camo. So yeah, there are red drums and black drums mixed in, uh, in there. Be careful, those rocks, they're uh, slippery. You have to come in this side. Oh, that's a beautiful red. Nice. Here. Bring him right there. That's a nice one. Ooh, careful. Yeah, let me let's wait for the wave. There you go. He is on the oh. net. Okay, I'll let him go then. There you go, guys. Thanks, Carlos. Yes, sir. I have to bring Carlos all the way from the other side. Let me get this hook out. You have a measuring? Yeah, I have it. Before we let him go. 22. 22 inches, guys. 22 inches. It's a little tough here, so we have to kind of throw him. Carlos on the rescue, man. Forgot that net. That was a 22 and a half inch redfish. Beautiful. Let's get another one. Nice. Fish on. Oh man, we're slaying them. We're slaying them. You're a good boy. Non-stop action, non-stop action, I like that. Let's go. Alright, alright, fish on. Oh, that's a nice one. Look at the size of it. Just saying, let's not lose the next big one, guys. 
We have no net, so we're not gonna bring colors again. We're gonna try to flip this guy. <laughs> oh, he is a good sheepy. I'll show you in a second, guys. Look at that. Right there. No move. Not the best place to measure, but... 17. 17! Alright, we got situated. We're bleeding them today. Now we're gonna give him another measure one. We are on a flat surface, man. It's kind of crooked here. Yeah, I have no net, so I have to use my towel and to, to have a good grip on them so I don't lose them, especially the big one. It might be 17 and a half. I measure 17, but it might be 17 and a half. We'll see. Let's go. Let's go for another one. He's on. Another nice one, guys. Another nice one. There you go. Jeez, it's coming for the rocks, man. Like a snapper. Come on, bro. Look at that. Oh, that's a good one. Huh? I don't want to get hurt. Another 15, I'll say. Yeah. If we get a giant, then we're gonna measure. The rest we're gonna eyeball them, 14, 15 inches. So yeah, we're throwing on the, a little farther on this side. And uh, let the waves move that crabby left and right. And man, they just love it. We're not even fishing near the rocks here. No. Oh, there he goes. Fish. Oh, that's a good one. That's another good one. Come on, sheepy sheepy. And they all trying to get them to the rocks today. All right. Yeah, it's, it's a twofer. Time you need this uh, towel, guys. You're not gonna hurt yourself or the fish that way. Don't worry, they're tough. Sheep said they're tough. They're not like trout, easy leaving the slime. Sheep is are tough. Protect your hands. In a way, you're protecting the fish as well, because faster release, better chances for the fish to leave. Let's go. Fish on. I'm still here. Small one, though. It's all right. Okay. Every time that I say I don't want to get wet, I get wet. Are we filming? Yeah, we are. The dolphin is waiting for them in the other side. There you go. Small. Nothing big though. Not that small, but... Another keep. Yeah, these guys are fast cookies. Yeah, let's get one more. Let's get some more. Oh, come on. I'm pushing for one more. Yeah. Let's get one more. You know how we always do it. One more, one more, one more. Oh, no, this is the last crap. We have to go and search for our friends' pompons too. Oh yeah. Uh, got me on the rock. Oh, got him out. I got him out. 
He got me on the rock for a second and I got him out. Eh, swallow. Oh well. Alright you guys, it got ugly here at Sam Key. A storm is moving in. It was me and Carlos today. We did some sheepset fishing. We did pretty good, right Carlos? We did amazing, Bush. Been, Thank you very much. It's been a while since I fished with Carlos, so I'll leave uh, his channel down in my description. Please give him a follow. He's trying to reach that 1,000 uh, mark. So overall, it was fun. I got a uh, redfish, a nice size redfish. We both got, he got a 17 and so, and I got almost 18 inch uh, sheep set. So again, guys, if you like today's video, please give us a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and we'll see you on the next one.